Good evening, junkies. Welcome to eminijunkie.com, your ES Trading Mentors free trading video for Thursday, August 27th, 2009. Today we have a total of three executable trade signals for a maximum potential of minus seven ES ticks. This video is for educational purposes only, is intended to highlight our high probability trade setups and give you a feel for the quantity of trades taken each trading day using this approach. A full trading plan and daily live trading room can be accessed via our website at eminijunkie.com. Okay, we opened up this morning basically right on top of our close for the last two days. Uh, we opened up at uh, 1,026.75 and obviously filled our gap, no problem. And we actually had a setup that happened right prior to the open and it pulled back, gave us the opportunity to get short shortly thereafter. That did produce targets one and targets two to the downside for nine ticks. And uh, we continued to move down through the previous day's low and the um, the Globex low and as this market dropped off we went all the way down and and tested the 1016 level and if you remember from last week that was a key breakout level and in the room room we've been discussing since uh, Monday morning that uh, the bulls needed to go down and retest this breakout to ultimately take the the market higher and that's exactly what they did they bounced off that level we got a signal to get long that did produce target one did not uh, get our second target um, prior to being stopped out of that second contract. So we ended up for a minus two tick loss in that second trade. And that cross to the downside, we got a signal to go short. And unfortunately, uh, we did not even get our first contract off on that particular trade. So that was a full stop out for 14 ticks. And then uh, we started trading higher. Now we got a signal to get long, but unfortunately we stopped trading as 1130 as junkies. We got the signal right at uh, about 1137, 1138. So that was out of our time frame to take the trade just due to the the volume that's during lunchtime, we avoid lunchtime trades. And, and sure enough, that was the trade that ended up going higher and uh, we didn't get any other signals for the rest of the day because that, uh, that move was a strong one. It was the, the main breakout level retest this morning down at uh, 1,016 uh, that the bulls were looking for and they took this market higher. Uh, hit, hit an old uh, resistance level and pulled back a little bit right at the open or right at the close there. but. Uh, for the most part, it was a pretty uh, resilient market, came down, tested a key breakout level from last week, took the markets higher, and uh, we had three opportunities today, uh, ended up with a minus seven ES ticks, and that's assuming that no one trailed or did anything, that's just taking the signals as they come. So anyway, um, I want to thank you for watching. For more details on this plan, including all the chart setups, or to join our live trading room or video newsletter, please visit eminijunkie.com. Thanks, and make it a great day.